Hello awesome viewers, how are you all? Welcome back to another video. Guys, in this video we are going to discuss Can we override static and private methods? This is one of the most asked interview questions. So, let's dive into it. So, let me create a class. So, I'll write a class private and uh, static. So, that's it. I don't want uh, main method for now. So, let us see what is overriding. Let me take this as a default class. So, let me write a method here void uh, display so i want to display my channel name let me take the channel as channel name is as a techno coder okay so i'll write one more class which extends class i'll just write class 2 class 2 extends class 1 what do you mean by extend it is just inheriting inheriting the properties if you want to modify if it wants to access, we are just inheriting the class. Okay. So, class 2 extends private and static class 1. So, what I am doing, I am just taking this. So, remember, the signature should be same if it does not have anything. And the name of the method should be same. Now, this is overriding. Okay. So, I will write here, my channel name is just other. Now, here what I will write, I will write my main method. So main method, I'll just access the object properties. Let's say class two reference variable equal to new class two. So I'll, I'll just write rv dot display and let us see what is the display here. Did it override? So let me write run as java application. So it override. So this is the concept of overriding. So now let us take same example. Let me write static. Okay, here also I will write static. So, here we are getting something. So, here change the access to static using class 2. Always it is saying change the access. Why? Static methods cannot be overridden. The reason being static methods are nothing but a common use for all methods. So, it is like it can the value cannot be changed. So, if the answer is like this, let us say static, I am just giving like this. So, to see, it is saying remove static modifier in class dot display because it cannot be overridden. Even if you write static, so we cannot create a variable for static. If you write class 2 dot display, if, if I run this, whatever is there in class 2, it will just write it. If I write private and static dot display, it will write that value. So, it will never override the value. Just run as Java application, channel name is as whatever the value is present. We cannot create a variable static. Directly, we can access it from class and we cannot override. So, one more uh, we will see a private, let us say private void uh, match, something like that. The same signal should be there. Okay. Let me write rv.match. We are getting an error here. What is error? So, we change the visibility to protected. What do you mean by that? So, if I change the visibility to protected, will it work? See, it will work. Because private has only access to this particular class. Two things here. Private methods cannot be overridden. Static methods cannot be overridden. Static methods are common for all. It is a common method. Static, the value cannot be changed. Private methods has an access value up to this class only, not beyond this. So, that is why we cannot overwrite private and static methods. So, hope you have understood the concept. If you have further suggestions, let me know in the comments below. That is it for the video guys. If you like the video, please click on like. If you are a new viewer, please click on subscribe. Till then guys, take care. Have a great day. Bye-bye.